love you, YouTube. My name is Wildboy5 and welcome to a game called Doki Doki Electric Club. Now, I've never heard of this game before. I have never heard anything about this game. I have no know what it is about. Then I am flying through my fucking T9 kit. Uh, I only playing this game for a couple of reasons. First off, when I did this game about two years ago, I never even ended up finishing the, rest of the entire game. So that's what we're going to do today. Uh, from today up until whenever, we're going to play, I'm going to release Doki Doki Electric Club. Uh, one episode per day, starting today up until whatever it means, so I don't know how long it's going to be. Now, I have played this game all the way through, not on camera. I have played it before, and I know what to expect from this game. I know it's a damn shame. This game has suicide, has dark, dark, dark subjects such as suicide, anxiety, depression, abuse, self-neglect, just self-harm, a lot, a lot of scary disturbing stuff. So if you don't like that stuff, I know it looks like a fun little anime dating game, but it's not, not nothing like that. But with that said, it is a really, really good game. And so, this is not the premium version, this is not the DLC Plus. I may find that sometime on Steam and do the premium version as well, along with the side stories, but we're going to play the original one here right now. I'm nervous about it, because I've this has been a year, long time since I've played the original game, but I do love it. So we're going to jump into this. Here we go. Here, into your name. Enter my name, Colton. Here we go. Hey! I see an annoying, woman, gr annoying girl running toward me from the distance, waving her arms in the air like she told the ability to any attention she might draw herself. That girl is Siori, my ne next door neighbor and good friend since we were children. You know, the kind of friend you never see yourself making today, but it just kind of works work out because you've known each other for so long. We used to walk to school together on days like this, but she started around high school. She would oversleep more frequently, and I would get up tired later. But if she's going to chase me like this, have like this, I must go better off running away. However, I just sighed out in front of her boss while the three catches me. Ah, <laughs> uh, we're slept again. But I caught you this time, baby. But only because I decided to stop and wait for you. Yeah, you say that like you're about you're thinking about ignoring me. Hey, to me, Colton. Well, if people stare at me for acting weird, I don't want them to think we're a couple or something. Fine, fine. But you did wait for me after all. I guess you didn't I guess you don't have it needed to be so mean if you wanted to. Whatever you say, Yori. Ah. We cross the street together and make our way to school. Excuse me. As we draw near the streets, we become increasingly speckled with other students and making their daily content costume. By the way, Colin, have you decided to join a club yet? A club? I told you, I told you already, I'm not interested in joining any clubs. I haven't been looking either. Eh, that's not true. You told me you would go you would join a club this year. Did I? I'm sure it's possible that I did. I'm not sure whenever a conversation with this, they get along with whatever she's going on about. Do you worry worries too much about me when I'm perfectly conscious of getting my average by spending my free time on games and anime? Uh-huh. I was talking about how I'm bored that you won't learn so or how to socialize or handy skills before college. Your happiness is really important to me, you know? And I know you're happy now, but I'll die at the thought of becoming a me in a few years when I'm not used to the real world. You trust me, right? Don't make me keep worrying about you. All right, all right. I'll just look for I'll look for a few clubs that let me be happy. No promises though. Well, at least promise you'll try a little. Yeah, I guess I promise you that. Yay! Why do I let myself get caught lecture by such a get free, such a carefree girl? More than that, I'm surprised I even let let myself relent on her. I guess seeing her worry so much is about the woman that she does again read the inside of my head. School day is ordinary as ever. It's over before I know it. After I pack my thing, it's seriously blank. Looking for motivation. Love. So you already wants me to check out some clubs. And yes, I am drinking the one later. Tell fight me. I guess I have no strong choice but start with the anime club. Hello. Theory. Story must have come into the classroom and I was space now. I look around and realize I'm the only one left in the classroom. I thought I'd catch you coming out of the classroom, but I saw you and your secretary snap, so I came in. Honestly, you're worse than me sometimes. I'm impressed. You don't need to wait out for me if you're going to make yourself late to your own club. Well, I thought I'd need some encouragement, so I thought, you know, know what? Well, then you can come to my club. You alright? Yeah. There's no way I am going in your club. Yeah, me neither. Yeah. Dory is vice president of the literature club. Not that I was aware of anything. She had any interest in literature. In fact, I'm 99% sure she only did because she would be on the side of the new club. Since, since she was the first to show interest after it was proposed, she inherited the title of Vice President. That said, my interest in literature is guaranteed to be less now. Yeah, I'm going to the anime club. Come on, please! 
Why do you care so much anyway? Well, I've kind of told the club yesterday I would bring a new member. And not to keep Mage Cupcakes and everything. Yeah. Don't make promises you can't keep. I can't tell if she was really that much of an issue. She's kind of the whole plan of my pop all this. I learned a long time. Alright, I'll stop by for a cupcake, okay? Yes, let's go. And thus today marks the day I sold my stool for a cupcake. I dejectedly follow Siori across the school and upstairs the section of the cell I rarely visit, but generally used to third year science and activities. Siori is full of energy, swings open the classroom door. Everyone, the new member is here. I told you, don't call me a new member. What? I glanced around the room. Girl run. Who's that? I don't know who she is. Welcome to the Literature Club. It's a pleasure meeting you. Diori always says nice things about you. Seriously, best girl right there, ladies and gentlemen. Best girl right there. Seriously, you brought a boy. Way to kill the atmosphere. Ah, Colton, what a nice surprise. Welcome to the club. All work to get me in this situation. This club is full of incredibly cute girls. What are you looking at? You want to say something? Say it. All right. Not a thing. <laughs> the girl with the sour attitude who is apparently nice and is the one I don't recognize. Her small figure makes me think she's the first year. She's also the one who makes cupcakes according to Yuri, and she's best girl. You can just ignore her when she gets moody. Yuri says that quietly into my ear and turns back way toward the other girls. Anyway, that, this is not Siki, full of energy, and this is Yuri, the smartest member of the club, my dumbass, that's smallest in the original video. Don't say things like that. Yuri appears to come on more turn and Jimmy seems to have a hard time keeping up with Sori. Siori not to keep. Well, it's nice to meet both of you. And it sounds like you're in little Monica, is that right? That's right. It's great to see you again, Colton. Monica smiles sweetly. We do know each other and we rarely talk, but we were in the same class last year. Monica was probably the most popular girl called Smart, Beautiful, Athletic, out of my league, not out of my league. Basically completely out of my league, exactly. So your smile is so getting too little. You too, Monica. Come sit, I'll go let me make room at the table so you can come sit next to me or Monica. I'll get the cupcakes. Hey, I made them. I'll get them. Sorry, I got a little too excited. Then how about I make some tea as well? The girls have a few desks arranged at the table. As Terry mentions, there's been one, there's one space next to Monica and one space next to Sorry, Natsuki and Yuri walk to the corner of the room where Natsuki grabs a tray and opens it up to the closet. Still feeling awkward, I take a seat next to Yuri. That's like he probably marched back to the table in the entry. Okay, are you ready? Ta-da! Oh, That's like he lifts the foil off the tray of the wheel. Does some white fluffy cut music for the little gas. The whiskers are drawn with icing and little pieces of chocolate for the make ears. So, girls. I had no idea you were such good bacon, bacon, Natsuki. Eh, well, you know. Sorry, I can take one. Story grabs one first, Monica and not follow. It's delicious! She already talks with her mouthful and hasn't managed to get a pricing on her face. I turned the cupcake around I turned the cupcake around in my fingers, looking the best angle to take a bite. Not that fucking hard to grab either. Now she is quiet. I can't help but notice she's thinking glance in my direction. She went on me to take a bite, and finally bite down. The ice is sweet and flavor one of the herself. It's really good. Thanks, Natsuki. Why are you thinking me it's not like haven't I heard this somewhere before? Made them for you or anything? Yeah, I thought I could, I thought you technically did, so you said, Well, maybe. Not for you, you dummy. Alright, alright. They give up on that because we're a lot of business in this conversation. Gary returns to the table carrying a tea set. She carefully places the key cup in front of us before sitting down the teapot next to her cupcake. Right? You keep a whole tray set, a whole tea set in the classroom? Don't worry, the teacher gives us permission. After all, this isn't a hot cup of tea go to help you enjoy a good book? I guess. I guess. <laughs> At least I forgot even if we said that. Don't let yourself get intimidated, you're just trying to impress you. Ah, uh, that's not! Insult that Yuri looks away. I mean, you know. I believe you. Well, tea and reading might not be a best stuff for me, but I do enjoy tea. Yeah, I'll stick to the one later for Coca-Cola. Alright, let's continue. I'm glad. Yuri faintly smiles to herself in relief. Monica ra raises an eyebrow but smiles at me. So what made you consider joining the litter club? Um, I was afraid of this question. Something tells me I should tell Monica that I was practically drowned here by Sior. Well, I haven't joined in the club yet, so you're racing really happy yourself. That's okay, don't be embarrassed. We'll make, we'll make sure you just go right at home, okay? As president of the Literature Club, it's my duty to make the club fun and exciting for everyone. Monica, I'm surprised. How can we decide to start your own club? You could probably be a board member of any of the major clubs. Weren't you a leader of the debate club last year? Ah, <laughs> well, you know, 
be honest, I can't stand all the politicals around the major club. It feels honestly nothing but argument about the budget, but probably he shows probably for events. I much rather take something personal and I enjoy making something special of it. And if encourage others to get into the Legend Club, I am fulfilling that dream. Monica is really a great leader. Yuri nods in agreement. Not lots of okay? I'm surprised there aren't more people in the club yet. It must be hard to start a new club. You can put it that way. Not many people are very interested in putting all that effort to start something brand new. Especially when something that doesn't grab your attention like literature. You have to work and convince people that this book fun and worthwhile. Woo! But it makes school events like festivals that more small and important. I'm confident that we'll really grow the club before we graduate. Right, everyone? Yeah! We'll do our best! You know it! Everyone enthusiastically agrees. Such different girls are all interested in the same goal. Monica must have worked really hard to find these three. Maybe that's why we're all... They were also the idea for my women's role. So, I still don't know if I can keep up the loop. Gosh, I have to play the fuck back. God damn. So, Cole, what kind of things you... What kind of things do you like to read? Uh, well... Considering how about the test, I don't really find a good way to answer that. I'm not... Thank you, welcome. I actually enjoy reading, believe it or not, Stephen King novels. I'm not, actually my favorite author is actually Stephen King. I don't know, there's something I really I mean I watched I watched his movies before I read the books, but as I got older, I bought a couple of his books from like Books of Million. I had a couple of teachers give me some of their books, Stephen King books, and I've just really loved this, really love Stephen King stories, especially the ones that made movies like The Shining, Kid, Kujo, um a lot of those, like I said, they're really, really cool. I'm a huge Stephen King fan. My dad likes Stephen King, but he likes Dean Coots better. Which I can understand. I might have requested myself half joking. Now he hit suddenly perks up. It looks like she wants to say something, but he's quiet. Not much of a reader, I guess. Well, that can change. What am I saying? I spoke without thinking of Yuri's sad smile. Anyway, what about you, Yuri? Well, let's see. Yuri tries to get a teacup on her finger. Maybe my. Maybe. My favorite word, uh, favorite are usually novels that build a complex fantasy world. The start, the level of gravity country should be how that was amazing to me. And telling a good story in such a foreign words is quickly impressive. Yuri goes on clearly passionate about her reading. She seems so reverse and timid I've walked it. But obviously, I believe her to ask to light up and find some comfortable world of books, not deep. But you know, I like a lot of things. Stories with deep psychological elements usually converse as well. Isn't it amazing how a writer can use to make a beat of little activation? Anyway, I've been reading a lot of horror lately. I read a horror book once. I just simply grasped the relate to middle level. At this rate, Yuri might as well have a conversation with my rock. Really? I wouldn't expect you that, Yuri. For someone as gentle as you, I guess you could say that. But a story makes me think takes me to another world that I can I can't tell I really can't put it down. Surreal horror is often successful changes the way you look at this book for a brief moment. Uh, I hate horror. Oh, why is that? Well, it's just not to get started for a split second. Never mind. That's right. You usually like to write cute things, don't you, Natsuki? What? What gives you that idea? You left the piece of scrap paper behind the last club meeting. It looked like you were writing something for a poem. Poem called Don't Say It Out Loud and Give It Back. Fine, fine. Yeah, your cupcakes, your poems, everything you do is just as cute as you are. So it's slides behind Natsuki and pat her head and shoulders. I'm not cute! That's the key, right? You write your own poem? Eh, I guess sometimes. Why do you care? I think it's very impressive. Why don't you share them someday? No! That's the key, I've heard your house. You wouldn't like them. Oh, not very confident writer, you. Yeah. I understand how Nazi you feel. Staring at level writing right takes this confidence. The truest of the form writer wants itself. You must be willing to open to your readers, exposing you something, and showing the deepest race of your heart. Do you have writing experience too, Yuri? Maybe if you share them, you can get an example of when that's he feels comfortable enough to share hers. Uh -huh. I guess it's the same for Yuri. Oh, I want to read everyone's poems. We all send sounds for a moment. Okay, I have an idea, everyone. Question mark. Yuri and Natsuki looks with Bizzle, uh, Quizzily at Monica. Let's all go home and write our Earl poem. Then, then, then next time we'll meet, we'll share it with the, each other. That way, everyone is even. Um, sir, yeah, let's do it. Plus, now that we have a new member, I think it gives us more confidence with each other than the Monica the club. Isn't that right, Cole? Monica smiled one lady once again. Hold on, there's still one problem. What's that? Duh, I never said I would join this club. At this rate, you should have when you walked into the fucking door. Sorry, I had me convinced to stop by, but I never made any decisions. I still have a close look at it now. I'll figure out all four of ourselves back in the But. 
I'm sorry, I thought. <laughs> oh, Dan. You all are defenseless against you girls. How am I supposed to make a clear head when it's like this? Alright. I decided then. I was running a letter club. One by one, the girls' eyes lit up. Yes! I'm so happy. Sarah wrapped her arms around me, jumping up and down. Hey! You really did scare me for a moment. If you really just came for the cookies, that would be super pissed. <laughs> that means you have to keep my This is official. Welcome to the village club. Thanks, I guess. Okay, everyone. I think with that, we can officially today's end, end today's meeting on a good note. Everyone remember today's tonight's assignment. Write a poem and bring it to the next meeting so we can all share. Monica looks over at me once more. Colt, I look forward to seeing what you how do you express yourself. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Can I really bless the class star Monica with my metaphor writing skills? I feel the anxiety welling up to me inside. Meanwhile, the girls continue to chit chat and Yuri cleans up the food. Hey, Colton, this Yuri, since Yuri, since we're already here, do you want to walk home together? That's right. See, you already not going to walk home together because you're going to stand in the Sure, might as well. Yuri. Mm. With this, that the two girls will make our way home. The whole way, my mind wanted back to go between the girl, four girls. Yuri, Natsuki, Yuri, and of course, Monica. Now, that's what I'm thinking about. That's, I honestly do not hate, because a lot of you know, a lot of games I've played. And like that, I always like a character, and I know there's always there's always one or two characters that I really hate. But when it comes to Doki Doki Village Club, I do not hate any of the girls. I just made like one person more than the next. So if you want my person of less of the girls, my my favorite girl is not Ski, and I think it'll go to Yuri, then Monica, and Yuri. I know a lot of people put Yuri as best girl, but in my opinion, I like. Uh, not to be the best. Then, Yori, Monica, Yuri. So. But I'd really be happy to spend every day at school in the lunch club. Perhaps I'll have a chance to one of closer to one of these girls. Alright! I just need to make my make time so I can good fortune to find me. I guess I'll start writing the poem tonight. Do 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 do. It's time to write a poem. Pick words you think your favorite club member will like. Something good might happen with whoever likes the poem the most. Alright, we're gonna say. Alright, let's continue. Alright, so what do we got? We're gonna start with Amazing, House, Sunny, Milk, Flower, Vanilla, Anger, Waterfall, Vicious. That's a year, that's a year one. Kojo. So we're gonna go to. Dazzle bubbles. I think we're gonna go towards not ski. I went. I mean, obviously the office. Well, so it doesn't matter. We're gonna go with pleasure lollipop. Fox skirt. Love. Daydream. She of. Uh, I guess we're gonna see your um uh, move. Yeah. Jump B. Last word. Um. Parfait. How about that? Hi again, Colton. Glad to see you didn't run away from us. Now, nah, don't worry. This might be a little strange for me, but at least I keep my word. While I'm back at the lyrics club, I was blessed to come in, so everyone else is already hanging out. Thanks for keeping your promise, Colton. I hope this is it. Oh, too overwhelming for a co of a commitment for you. Making you dive head first into the when you're not accustomed to it. Oh, come on, like he deserves any slack. Jerry told me you didn't even want to join the Gummy Clubs this year. And last year, too. I don't know if you just plan just to come here and hang out or what, but if you don't take it seriously, then you won't see the end of it. Now, you certainly have a big mouth for somebody who used to make make manga collection clap. So. No! That's like you find yourself between manga and manga. Manga is literally perfect! Briefly detained the Natsuki plot back into proceed. Don't worry guys, Colton always gives us his best while as long as he's having fun. He helps me with busy work without me asking. Like cooking, cleaning my room. How dependable. Jerry, that's because your room is messy and isn't sticky. And you almost set your house on fire once. Is that so? <laughs> you two are really good friends, aren't you? 
I might be a little jealous. How come you and Colton become good friends too? Um, Steori. Mm hmm. As usual, Steori seems to believe this is the worst situation just for me. Oh, Yuri brought you something. Yuri. Oh, yeah. Oh, Yuri even brought you something today, you know? Wait, Steori. Me? Not really. Don't be shy. It's really nothing. What is it? Never mind. Yuri made it sound like a big deal, and it's really not. Uh, what do I do? I'm sorry, Yuri. I wasn't thinking. I guess that just means the rescue the situation. Hey, don't worry about it. First of all, I wasn't expecting anything in the first place. So it's a nice gesture from you. It's a pleasant surprise. It'll make me happy no matter what. Is that so? I won't make a big deal if you won't want it to be. Alright. Well, here. Yuri reaches the back and pulls out a book. I didn't want you to feel left out, so I picked up a book I thought you might enjoy. Why, Cash? It's a short read, so keep the uh, keep your attention if you don't usually read, and we can, you know, discuss it if you want it. It says, How is this girl accidentally being so cute? She even picked out a book she thinks all life is about me not reading much. Yuri, thank you. I'll definitely read this. Enthusiastically take the book. Well, you can read at your own read at your own pace. I look forward to hearing what you think. Now that everyone's settled in, I think Mom really kick up the schedule activities with them. But that doesn't seem to be the case. Yuri and Monica are having a cheery conversation with Mona. Yuri's face is already buried in the book. I can't help but notice her, especially she was waiting for the chance. Meanwhile, Natsuki is rumbling around the closet. Who are we going to? Ugh! I hear Natsuki at her expression. We're going to That's the Natsuki route, baby! I approach her and she gives a hand. Hello, Natsuki, best girl. You looking for something in here? Freaking Monica! And she then puts my stuff back in the right spot. What's the point of keeping the collection organized if you're gonna mess it up? And that's really sides a bunch of stack books and boxes across the shelf. Manga. You read manga, right? Ah, uh, sometimes. Manga is one of those things where you can't admit you really into it until you figure out where the other person stands. How do I know? How do you know anyway? I heard you bring it up at some point. Besides, it's kind of written on your face. What's that supposed to mean? Let's see. There's a low volume of uh, stack berries on the shelf. Here it is. I pull up the stack. There it is. That's when he snatches it out of my hand. She then turns the box and then just slips the volume right into the belt of the breast. Much better. Seeing your box is probably the most irritating side of the world. I know how, you, how that feels. I get it closer to the box she's my Parfait girls. It's a series I never heard in my life. That probably me saw her. That probably means there's any way to. If you're gonna judge, then you can go right through that glass on that door. She points to the glass door. Hey, I wasn't judging or anything. I didn't even have to say anything. It was a tone in your voice. But I'll tell you one thing, Colton. Consider this a lesson straight from the literature track. Listen with the hopper locker to the literature club. Don't judge equally by its color. In fact, that's he pulled out the first volume of the Parfait Girls. I'm going to show you exactly why. She shoves the book right into my hands. I stare at the cover. It features four girls and color enemies to King of Foes. Like this. Ha <laughs> Coincidence. It's extremely mo. Don't just stand there. What? Natsuki grabs my arm and pulls me out of the closet. She then takes a seat against the wall beneath the windowsill. She pats the ground next to her saving the seat. Wouldn't chairs be more comfortable? They take the seat. Chairs wouldn't work. We can't read at this we can't read at the same time like that. Why is that? I guess it's easier said and done like this. Yeah, don't just do that. You'll make it feel weird. you make me feel worried about it. I see you crush the drums, which is an inch away from me. Sorry. I didn't exactly bet to be standing clo close to this either. Now that I can say it's practically a bad thing, I opened the booklet. It's only a few seconds before Natsuki and inches closer began the initial space she hopes I won't know. I can feel her peering over my shoulders more eager began as reading. Wow, how long has it been since I read the beginning? Hmm? You don't go you don't go back and flip through the older volumes every now and then? Not really. Maybe sometime I already finished the series. Hey, are you paying attention? Uh, I am, but nothing's really happening, so I can't talk at the same time. It looks like a bunch of different friends in high school typically slice off of life affair. I kind of grew on this since it's rare Ryan Paul's entertaining, inter entertaining enough to keep me alive and plot. So, what should I expect from this? Is this, gonna be, is this going to be a plot? Well, obviously, you don't. You would think I enjoy something that didn't have a plot. I mean, well, I guess I know what you're saying. A lot of the beginning simple things, like there's really a funny chapter, they're obsessed with the guy, a nice creep shot, but that's just something, but that's just helps you get to know the characters. And besides, it's still entertaining. Well, later on, there's this kind of drama, like we get up to the backstories when some of the romantic starts happen. That's really what makes it so good. There are so many touching parts. Is that so? Sounds like you really know what you're talking about. 
Maybe I'll underestimate you. Hee <laughs> hee. Hey, wait. What's that supposed to be? Nothing. I should give you a little shove. I just meant I haven't seen anyone seeing you at your full power. Hmm, good save. And this chapter seems like, like, is like about bacon. This is just a guess, but there's a lot of bacon in manga. Manga, well, it's not to keep us for when she doesn't want to make some. Yeah. Why does that matter? It doesn't, I was just curious. Since you enjoy bacon too, right? That's just a coincidence. I just happened to get into bacon around the same time I got into this manga. Is it manga or manga? I can feel less. Like I wouldn't even ever get into anything because it's a manga. I feel bad for everyone that's irresponsible and press the pull. Aha! Definitely not a coincidence. I guess that explains not to keep interest in bacon. Still, a lot of the hobby fit for manga that's definitely one of the better roles. Not to mention she's really good at it. Good at it. Oh, I am the judge. Oh, that's cute! Da da. We read on for a few more minutes. I finished a couple of I finished a couple of chapters of one. Da da. Are you sure this isn't too boring for you? It's not. Even though you're just watching me read, well, I'm fine with that. If you say so. I just find I just guess it's fun sharing something you like with someone else. I always get excited when I convince my friends to pick the series and You know what I mean? Hmm. You don't? Uh, that's not. Well, I wouldn't really know. What do you mean? Don't you share manga with your friends? Did you not rub it in? Jeez. Sorry. Hmm. Like I get it. You get. Ever, like, I could never get my friends to read this. They just think manga is for kids. I can't even bring it out them with being all like, Yeah, you still haven't grown out of that, have you? It makes me want to punch the right in their suckle. Uh, I know what the, I know those kind of people. Honestly, it takes a lot of effort for friends to judge what's more or less to do it. I'm already kind of a loser, so I got to towards the other week. But it's probably harder for someone like you. Huh. Yeah, that's pretty accurate. Wait, which part? I mean, I feel like I can't even keep it in my own room. I don't even know what my dad would do if, I, if he found it. At least it's safe here in the club room. Except Monica keep being a jerk about it. Uh, I just, I just can't wait, can I? Hey, I got that on my shirt. That's what the shirt says. My shirt says I have a shirt of Natsuki. Kind of like all glitched out. Kind of the same thing with Yuri. I've seen a couple of videos. It has Natsuki being glitched out. It says I can't. I just can't wait, can I? They're all glitched out. It's really cool. Well, it kind of paid off in the end, did it? I mean, here I am breeding it. Well, it's not like I've solved any of my problems. Maybe. But at least you're enjoying yourself, right? Eh, so? Ah, jeez, that's enough. Are you gonna keep reading or what? Yeah, yeah. I'll flip through the page. Suddenly, now she starts that. Oh, I see that. Thank you. She got a little thing. That's nice. Aha, I totally forgot that part happened. Now she puts a finger on one of the panels. Min Min Minori is one of my favorite. It's my favorite character. You always feel bad for her since she's so unlucky. But especially when bad went. Uh, I shouldn't be talking about that yet. Just finish the chapter. Natsuki's voice sparkles with the excitement. It starts to contract and usually bosses down, but if she's not used to staring her favorite manga with the friends, I can understand why. It's hard to express words if only you can give connecting with someone like that. And being able to thrive rather than that, Natsuki was a rare experience. So that makes me smile to myself. Okay, everyone! Eh? Are you, uh, are you ready? Oh, are you all ready with today's poem? Oh, come on! Could you just be, could you time me any worse? Sorry. I just need to make sure we have enough time. Though you do look pretty cozy over there. Uh, ah. Let's get to how close she's gotten to me. She has like fooled herself a good, good 12 inches away from me. Alright. Guess I'll stop here for now. I closed the book and hit the towards not you're, you're just giving it back? Don't you want to know what happens? Yeah, but Monica just said, Don't be dumb. Just take it home with you. Eh, is that really alright? I see most likely. Well, of course, it would take forever to finish it. Let's finish it before you get home tomorrow. Before, before tomorrow, so we can start the next one. And if it gets banned, I'll kill you. By tomorrow, I only get part way through the volume, through the volume so far. I might fall behind as we get through this, but I'll be surprised if it's necessary to see the an enthusiastic face. Or am I just scared of what happened? All right, then. I stand up. I rush on the way, I put myself at the book in my bag. By the way, do you remember the ride home last night? Yep. My relaxation ends. I can't believe I agreed to do something so embarrassing. I couldn't really find much inspiration since I've never done this before. Well, that everyone was pretty. Why don't you share? Why don't you find something to share with us? I can't wait. Scary Monica and Tuesday brought out their poems. Jerry's the book of Blue Seas from Smile On. On the other hand, Monica was the first to know, but I can already see Monica's in the air right from where I stood. Let's get Yuri. I'll do the same myself. Okay, we're gonna save. 
Okay, that's so much better. I can finally step back as a spoon for the show. She's gonna fall upon the first magic key. It's all magic give me a chance to turn home yesterday. It's probably the only one I share mine with. Let's share mine first. Hmm. Okay, well, let's start with the things I don't like. First of all, um. Let's give me a my phone. Never mind, I don't feel like giving you my opinion. Is there a whole. Is that the whole point of sharing the first thing? I wrote this so I could be doing other things. Uh, in fact, remember how I said I wanted to read your poem? That's what I had in mind with the Rand Iron Scales. I wanted to help you feel comfortable unless you share yours. Like Monica said, uh, well, I wouldn't be more comfortable sharing my poem if it wasn't really yours for the idea. You were supposed to show me how dumb poems can make you go, ha, huh? well, it's not the great thing, but let me show you what real literature looks like. And you went to ruin it. I hope you're happy. So in other words, you're saying you don't like it? Ugh! That's to give Red George to get them. Oh, you're so... You just don't understand anything, do you? I already told you that you don't have to go announce things in the world stuff before. Pretty sure you reluctantly said that. I said that mostly to myself. That's you must really hate me or something. I can't figure out when you lose unless you like my phone. In any case, you still need to show me yours, right? Fine, I guess. Only because Monica went if I don't. Eagles can fly. Monkeys can climb. Crickets can leap. Horses can race. Owls can see, kids can run, eagles can fly, people can travel, that's about it. Yeah! I told you you were gonna like it. I liked it. What? Just be honest. I am. Why are you so convinced that I wouldn't like it? Well, because everyone in the high school thinks that Ryan is being all self assisted and stuff. Some people can't even take my Ryan seriously. But isn't the point of the most to express yourself? Your Ryan style will make you message less invalid. Yes, exactly. I like it when it's easy to read, but it hits you hard. Like this poem. Seeing that everyone go around and be really disturbing. So I decided to write about it. Yeah, I understand. But then other things simple. Like I said, I read. <laughs> it helps you bring the feeling like last time. So he did, did. I guess you went the real lot more than realized. That's what it meant to be a pro. I'm glad you learned something. Didn't expect you from the youngest here, did you? Guess not. I said the humor with the last, last comment. I don't really care how old everyone is, but that's his feeling problem. I'll take that away from her. Fiore! This is a good poem. Are you sure it's the first time? Of course! That's not any good. A fungo. I'm the kind of guy who would be right close to spare time. I guess you're right. Well, that's what impresses me. Well, to be honest, I was afraid you would do you wouldn't take it you or that you would write one at all. I'm really happy you just wrote one. It just reminds me of really important club now. Not to mention the fact I'm still standing in front of you in the club room. Oh well of course. I'm not really into it yet, but it doesn't mean I'll break my promise. See? Like I said, like I said before, Cole, deep down you're not selfish after all you know, at all, you know, trying to do things for this other people. It's something the only good people can do. Thanks, Diori. I'm not sure if she ever sees the full picture of my motive here. Then again, I can really deny she's part of the reason I feel like knowing how much it means for her and all. Yeah. And I'm gonna make sure you have lots of fun here. That way that'll be my way of thanking you. Alright, I'm gonna hold you to that then. Yay. Now if you now you read my poem too, right? Don't worry. <laughs> we'll see about that. Dear Sunshine, the way you glow through the blinds this morning makes me feel like you may have kissed before right out of my bed, making me feel sleepy with my eye. I mean, come on, player, you're trusting me to rainy day. I'll look above the sky as blue as the secret that I trust you. If it wasn't for you, I could sleep forever, but I'm not mad, I won't break. Diori? Yeah, this is just a guess, but did you wait until this morning to write this? No. Just a little bit. You can answer that just a little bit, yes or no question. I forgot to do it last night. Well, at least that makes me feel better about myself. Don't be mean. I still try my best. Yeah. I didn't mention to say it wasn't. I did. I didn't mean to say it was a bad poem. It came out nice. I'm sure I put it. It sounds just like you. Really? Yeah. Especially like the last line. I made eggs and toast. Even though you were late for school, it's bad to skip breakfast. I get all cranky. Well, I guess there's no point arguing. Anyway, thanks for showing me. <laughs> this was so much fun. Monica's the best. Yeah. But next time I won't forget. And I'm gonna write the best poem ever. I guess I look forward to it. Monica. Hi, Monica. Hi, Cole. Having a good time so far? Yeah. Good. Glad to hear it. By the way, since you're new here and everything, if you ever have any suggestions or clever like new activities or things we can do about it, I'm always listening. Don't be afraid to bring new things up, okay? All right. I'll keep that in mind. Of course, I'll be afraid of things to bring things up. I'm much one of. Anyway, want to share your poem with me? 
It's kind of embarrassing, but I guess I have to. Aha! Don't worry, Colton. We're all members. Yes, it's also a very related to get it. Yeah, that's true. I hand my my poem. Hmm. I like it. Really? It's a lot cuter than I expected. Uh, oh, jeez. No, no. It kind of makes me think of Nazi something Nazi right? She's a good writer, too. So I'll take that as a compliment. Uh, if you say so. Yep. By any chance you've written anything. By Shell's difference, I've heard of it. Eh, maybe a long time ago. He's finished the town council store with a few simple words. These poems can be endearing, even said. And sometimes only a few long lines. They may even feel like with kids, but if you think about it, they can express you use the word and apply it. I see. Are you saying that now that he's like that? Sort of. Maybe she's not an expert. Maybe she's an expert. They, have not, they might be easy to write. So I can see why we can do that poem before. I'm sure you end up different. different like, it can take a while, but I feel comfortable doing this. That's okay. I do love seeing you try new things. Everyone else would be a little embarrassed to live style. But I'm always here to help a conversation about So don't force yourself. It's not like you have to worry about impressing them or anything. Aha. Aha. Anyway, do you want to read my poem now? Don't worry. I'm not very good. You sound pretty confident if you don't me. Not good. Well, it's because I have to sound confident. That doesn't mean it's straight, you know. Let's see. Well, let's read it then. Hole in the wall. Could have been me. She's a very stupid little over deep and deep left side. Blue, no, I, no, I can't see Riches. Left too many legs, everything's already scratched with. And he on the other side was looking. So, what do you think? Hmm, it's very freeform, that's what I call it. Sorry, I'm not really the right person to ask for feedback. Uh, uh, yeah, it's kind of style, it's good popular nowadays. It's a lot of poems with professors at any time. Well, perform out loud, it can be really powerful. What's your inspiration behind this one? Uh, well, I'm not sure how to put it. I guess you could say I had some experience. It's been able to do my poems a bit. And empathy. Yeah, something like that. I'm kind of nervous to talk about the deep stuff because it's really final. Maybe after everyone is better friends with each other. Anyway, here's Monica's writing tip of the day. Sometimes when you write in a poem or strong, your brain gets to fifteen writing. Make a point. If you try to make it perfect, you'll never make any progress. Just force yourself. Don't try to that. Another way to think about it is, if you keep the pen up, lungs fun, follow me. Just move your hands and open the flow. That's my mind tip advice of the day. Thanks for listening. On to Yuri. Hmm. 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 You research on my poem. And then it passes this enough. Um. Oh! Shall we? I forgot to, forgot to start speaking. Um. It's fine. Don't force yourself. I'm not. I just need to put my thoughts into words. Hold on. Okay. This is your first time writing a poem, right? Yeah. Oh, yes. I'm just making sure. I guess that might be his, after all reading through. Uh, so it's that bad? No. Did I just use my voice? I'm so sorry. Yuri buried your face into her hands. I couldn't help but notice there's been several minutes and we haven't got anywhere. It might take a while to get used to the film. It's fine. I did. What are you? What were you saying? Right. Um. It's just that there's some people writing habits of writing, and having been through it myself, I kind of learned to pick them up. I think the most noble thing I recognize is trying to make them relatable. In other words, you tend to pick up writing. The end of the result. Once you're a master fan of thought, you different. Your stammer is completely gone, but it sounds like an expert. Of course, that's nothing that can be blamed for. Uh, there are many different skills that can go into writing stuff. No, it's just fine and they're very good. It might take you some time, but I'll come to practice being Almost to help the skills give you plus from feedback. That's the key can be a little biased, though. Biased? Ow. Um, well, never mind. I should be talking about people like that. Sorry. It's fine. I'm not sure if you're apologizing yourself to me or not, so do you mind if I read your poem now? Please do. I'd love to share my thoughts across the spine. Gary smiles extremely rare opportunity for her. This is kind of funny. After all, isn't this supposed to be a literature club? Ghost in the light. Da -da 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 I flicker back. I'm sorry, I have such terrible handwriting. What? I wasn't thinking that at all. But you always took a long time to read. Ah, uh, well, I just don't read script very often. I actually thought your handwriting is pretty. Eh, that's a relief. Also, I like the poem. Even though it was short, it's really descriptive. It wasn't too short. I under usually about long, but not at all. I'm really glad you liked it. I'll be honest. This is our first time sharing. I wanted to write something like a level mile. Something for yeah. Are you into ghost theory? Uh huh. I actually, like the story. Actually, the story isn't about a ghost at all, bro. Really? I must have totally missed the point. Well, I suppose you only know, glanced over it after all. But remember the poems that we read for cross-page parents There were. They usually do more simple story painting. In that case, we're not the subject. Of the ghost. Thank you. 
lot lingering or less for me to go to the past. It shouldn't have be left for nothing. That's more solemn to think of that way. I haven't even thought of that. That's impressive. It's nothing, really. Well, it makes me happy to think that. Just remember that I won't be alone before you pick up one of these, all these things. Yeah, maybe you're right. I guess I'll have to keep trying. I'm counting on you. Whew. That was too much. Phew. I guess that's everyone. I glanced around the room. There was a little bit more stressful than I anticipated. Uh, it's uh, everyone's judgment radical red. Even if there's being nice, there's no way Paul can stand up there. This is a lyrics club after all. I sigh. I guess it's what I'm going to get myself to. Across the room, Sierra Monica and Jed and my eyes land on Yuri and Natsuki. They gin 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 gingerly peach paper. As they read a poem, I watch the expressions. Natsuki, eyebrow frustration. Meanwhile, you're a small savvy. What's with this language? Huh? Eh? Did you say something? Oh, it's nothing. Smoothly around the poem. I guess you could say it's fancy. Thanks. Yours is cute. You? Did you completely miss the symbol of life or something? It's clearly about the feeling of giving up. How can you be that cute? I know that. It's just meant, I just meant the language, I guess. I was trying to say something nice. Eh. You mean you have to try that hard to come up with something nice to say? Thanks, but I really didn't. It, but it didn't really come out nice at all. Uh, well, I do have a couple suggestions. Hmm. If I, if I was looking for this, I would ask somebody if you liked it. Which people did, by the way. You already liked it, and Colton did too. So based, so based on that, I'm glad to give this just on my own. First of all, excuse me, I appreciate the offer, but I spent a lot of time it. I don't expect you to change anytime soon unless, of course, I come from, which I haven't yet. And Colton liked my phone too, you know. He even told me that he was impressed by it. That's he slowly stands up. Oh. I didn't realize you were so nervous trying to pass our new club member, Yuri. Yeah, uh, that's not what I said. Uh, you were just... Maybe your stands up as well. Maybe you're just jealous that Colton appreciates my advice more than he appreciates yours. Huh? How do you know the advice more? That's... Are you full of... that full of yourself? Uh, no. If I was full of myself, I would definitely go out of my home and make everything I do out of really cute. Uh, um, if everyone okay, well, you know what? I wasn't the one to choose booth pants like you a big size when she was cold and started showing up. Ooh, Natsuki! Oh, um, Natsuki, that's a little. This doesn't involve you. I don't like fighting, guys. Suddenly, Buff Girls went towards me as good. Colton, she's just trying to make me look bad. That's not true. She started it. If she could come appreciate that sense more efficient. I just played. Da 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 is there only way to convert myself? Um, um, well, uh, do you know what I mean? Uh, na, 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 na. Siori! That's the key! Yuri! Yuri! Siori! Yeah? Yeah? Everyone's fighting and making Siori, making Siori uncomfortable. How can you two keep fighting when you know you're making a friend, maybe for your friend, Colton? Well, that's her problem. This isn't about her. I agree. It's unfair, but others in your direct you feel like i Yeah, unless Yuri wants to tell you she's a stuck up jerk she's being. She would never. It's your two million girls upset in the first place. Excuse me? Are you listening to yourself? This is exactly why exactly why nobody likes you. Stop Not to be Yuri. You guys are my friends. I just want everyone to get along and be happy. My friends are wonderful people, and I love them because of their differences. Not to these poems, they're amazing because they give so many feelings in just a few words. And yours poems are amazing because they paint beautiful pictures in your head. Everyone's so talented, but why are we fighting? Because, well, also, not to these cute, cute, and there's nothing wrong with that. And Yuri's boobs are the same day always work. Big and beautiful. Uh... The Ari, very stands up kind of I like a stands behind everyone with expression. I'll make some tea. Yuri rushes off. Now he gets to stand with a blank switch there and open. So this is why it's Yuri's vice president. I wish for my honor. She's not to return. To be honest, I might come off as a good leader, but I can't look at nice and things. But I'm not very good with people. I couldn't even bring myself to interject. As president, that's kind of embarrassing. Uh, nah. It's not like I could blame you. I wasn't able to say anything or either. Well, I guess it's just I mean, it just means that Yuri's amazing on her own fault. On her own. You can say that. She might be an airhead, but sometimes she's weirdly suspicious that she knows exactly what she's doing. I see. Take good care of her, okay? I would hate to see someone get hurt. That makes two of us. You can count on me. I'm like a smile, sweet
like get the chance to talk to her a little bit more. I don't know. Okay, everyone, it's just about time for us to leave. How do you feel about sharing your poems? It was a lot of fun. Well, I said before, I said it was alright, well, mostly. But then, how about you? Yeah, I say the same. It was near and beautiful. Awesome. And that game will do the same thing tomorrow. And maybe we'll learn something from your friends too. Your poems will turn out even better. I think to myself. I did learn about poor poems life. And with letting it, which means you press and goes on. I want to impress. I don't know myself. Nick. Colton, ready to walk home? Sure, let's go. It's very memes at me. I truly been a lot of story. I spent much time together. I can't really say I'm enjoying it either. Shiori. About what happened earlier? Eh, what do you mean? You know, between the fight and Yuri not to eat. Does that count? Does that sort of thing happen? No, no, no. They're usually the first time I've ever seen a fight like that. I promise they're both wonderful people. You do hate... No, I don't hate them. I just wanted my opinion on it, all. I can see what makes good friends with you. You! You know, Colton, it's nice that I can spend my time with you, but I think you're good. But I think you get along with everyone that makes me the happiest. And I think everyone will really like you, too. That's... Okay. Every day is going to be so much fun. Sigh. It looks like Siri has a change cross situation. If you're being friends with everyone, it's nice, but does it really need to stop there? Well, we just have to see what the future holds here. I pat Siri on the shoulder. I said that to myself. They heard about it's easy to change them all. Okay. Yeah. Let's do this. And on that, we are ending the video on a good note before we get into some darker shit. So thank you guys a lot for watching. If you did, make sure you give it a thumbs up, comment, subscribe, and sure to check out my social media down below. As always, thank you guys a lot for watching. I'll see y'all in a future video. Take it easy.